Hello everyone, are you ready to end a fucking adventure? I'm here with Zenrot. Hello. And we're gonna finish off Pokemon now. Uh, as you can see right Ball here... determination. Yes, I mad-leveled everyone <laughs> to 55 at least. <laughs> but before we can get to the Pokemon League, we have to catch the last whale. We have to catch, uh... What was it, Nan Nano Elartris? Yeah, Nano Elartris. Damn, you know what's one of the funniest thing is that when I put out like, oh, what's can you tell why the won't fit? I just realized I don't think probably not. We'll figure it out. Well, first of all, we have to catch a uh, nano. How about that? Let's not put the cart before the horse. It's true. Uh oh man, the world's strong. You know, one of the last moves fucking Toast tried to learn was fire spin. Yeah, fire spin always comes super late. I have no idea why. It's not good. I think it's because in Gen One it does this. It causes a lock, so it's only good uh... in Gen One. Well, yeah. it was good competitive in some generations because you can't switch out. Yeah. See, now this you is had a... had someone like an Infernape out and your opponent, you knew your opponent was going to switch something in. You could fire spin, catch whatever they had, and then switch to a counter and they couldn't get away. Yeah, apparently fire spin is very good when it just is good at annoying you. To just so make it... it's a Pikachu, so I mean... I mean, yeah. It's a, the world's strongest Pikachu, please. It's Chase. Look it's at true. him. Look at him fucking... Ah, fully paralyzed. Size bird. Yeah. Dumbass bird. Sorry, Nano. You're a very nice guy. <laughs> the thought of Pikachu grabbing a flaming bird and slamming it into the ground is really great. It is. Now, here's the part where I go, do we start catching him? Because he's Ooh, real weak. The math is very close. I might just switch to uh, JX and let him... Because we don't have any weak moves anymore. This is kind of it. The weak moves are gone. Only thing left is strong boys. True. I we're think he, all strong. we're all big boys right now. He has bite. Do you think he can make take a like a little nibble out of uh, Nano? Uh, maybe. Tiny nibble. Let's see. Jax, don't crit. Don't crit. Don't crit. God's sake! Don't oh crit. my god, <laughs> that was so close. <laughs> but he didn't crit. He didn't crit. That was the important the thing. Moltres has no way to deal damage to itself. Are you gonna be a nice guy and actually go in super easy? Oh my wow. God, one ball. All right. Because Nano's so nice. It's true. He's so goddamn polite. Yeah. So when I asked people why are they this, these specific Pokemon, it was one. One person said Zipri was Zapdos because he's black. Another person. <laughs> one of my favorite put down the reason <laughs> is is that I think Nano was the cool. A lot of people basically were just shitting on <laughs> Rhyme as Articuno because he's like, and Rhyme is the worst because he's because he's Articuno, right? It's like no. <laughs> That's not what I was trying no, to say. I like Articuno. I like Articuno too, and I like Rhyme. Don't fucking attack Rhyme. This wasn't a... Nan. <laughs> I just realized me saying, what's wrong with Articuno? I like him is basically... <laughs> it sounded like I was saying, why would you compare Rhyme to Articuno? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, come on. We'll wait till... It, it fits, uh, by the way. It just fits. Nettle Archers. Perfect. And he was the easiest one to catch. Nice. Let's get the fuck out of this cave. Actually, there's two more things we need to do before uh, we finish up. One is we have to evolve Hope. I asked Hope. I asked her. He was like, hey, sorry to bother you. Do you mind being an Eevee? Because we made you an Eevee. And she was like, bother me anytime. And also, please make me Vaporeon. <laughs> so, uh, for the love of God. For the love of God. If you're going to do one. So let's quickly take out Toast. Because Toast is the... Let's be honest, the weak point of the team, if we're going to look at someone. <laughs> He's the one who's caused me the most pain, that's for sure. The one I look at and go like, why do you hurt me so? Uh, there you go, Waterstone. So now Hope gets to evolve. If I was smart, I would also evolve maybe one of the Nidorans into Nidu King, but we're here to finish this game. Not here to... Yeah. Evolve everyone we can. Here for victory and only victory. Exactly. We're here for fucking victory. Uh, or embarrassing losses where we then end the series having been defeated. Yeah. Also, we're not uh, stopping until this shit is done. So if I lose in one case, we're just going to continue the episode until they're fucking beat. Which so means you're about to buy 700,000 uh, full restores, doesn't it? I have no money left. <laughs> So, oh god, <laughs> I think we have like 12 full restores, something revives, and something whatever. 
Now here's the, one of the last things we had to do because now that you don't need dig anymore, it's time to you teach you your strongest move. Fissure is it? Oh, nope. thank God! <laughs> it's earthquake. We don't. I'm... Wow, J Jack Santos can learn this, but I think it's more fitting that you learn it. I can't believe you don't naturally learn it. Yeah, the Gen One uh, uh, learn tables were not that great. No, not great. I'm going to get rid of Dig. Because, again, we ain't going to be needing it. You learn to cause earthquakes. All right, let's heal up. And let's go take down Lorelei. Is that her name? That is the first woman, yes. Okay. Lorelei. Lorelei. The ice slash water. Mostly water, because ice was like, what, two, two dudes? It was like Jinx and Seal and Lapras. Yeah. And uh, Dugon. I still love fucking Seal. I think I've said it before. I think Seal has the funniest, uh, just how he speaks is the funniest in all of Pokemon. Oh, the one where he's like, Seal. Yeah, where he goes, Seal. Seal. <laughs> Seal. There's my brother in the background doing a tiny Dugon <laughs> to, to contribute. <laughs> all right, let's go. Welcome to the Pokemon League. I am Lorelei of the Elite Four. No one can best me when it comes to icy Pokemon. Freezing moves are powerful. Your Pokemon will be at my mercy when they are frozen solid. Ha ha! Are you ready? Let's see if I can do this. I wonder if you can use Surf on the background there and fish. Catch Pokemon. That well, would be cool. Why is she on her knees? <laughs> uh, reasons. <laughs> this is a family show, Zen. How dare you try and take this to a horrible place? <laughs> Go Thunder. Acid hit. Yes. If Chase Please can kill though. If Chase hits every single time with Thunder, he's going to one-shot everyone. Oh, crit to Jesus. That's because Chase is fucking ready for this. He's like, whatever, I'll take some EXP. I'll take down the giant vagina monster that is Cloyster. Take it down. No, why'd you miss? Oh, no, this is unfortunate. This calls a lock? Yeah, it's a lock. See, I understand why they eventually removed this mechanic, because it's fucking annoying. It's not it fun... Sure it's not fun to fight. You just kind of like have to sit there and take it for like a good number of turns. And again, depending on the Pokemon, it either deals way too much damage or just enough damage. There we go. Gonna give him a max potion. Can't have him die here. Hopefully this ends. Oh, oh God. All right. Fuck it. Switching the Thunderbolt. Because now I'm asking too many variables for him. One to not be confused. Oh, God. Chase, please. Chase, you got this, bro. Yes, confuse no more, nice. Thunderbolt. Out of my goddamn face. So apparently I also learned this. This is something... Wow, double crits back to back. <laughs> like I said, he's fucking ready. Apparently if you kill with Hyper Beam in Gen 1, it does not... Um, it doesn't take up your turn. At all. So if you just one-shot with Hyper Beam, one of the strongest oh, moves... yeah, you don't have the... The cooldown thing, you mean? No. Yeah, exactly. So here's my thing. I am now going to seismic toss the shit out of the slow bro. Because Chase is just <laughs> picking up all these giant Pokemon. Yeah! <laughs> seismic toss. Oh, Jinx. You know what? I think it's uh, time for Toast to see if Toast has learned any lessons. Oh, poor old style Jinx. <laughs> poor unfortunate Jinx. Oh, God. <laughs> That's been better. Oh, yeah. Also, he doesn't have um, Fire Blast anymore. He finally learned Flamethrower. So maybe one time he's actually going to be useful and actually kill Jinx. Thank you, Toast. God. Did all, it. All that tough love finally paid off. And Lapras. Who's good to finish off Lapras? I think it's Chase again. Here's my problem is that I think Lapras might be just a tank of some kind. So, I'm hoping Thunder can take him out in one hit. We can one and done him. No. Uh, Not Body Slam. Please don't paralyze. Actually, don't kill Chase, because Chase is just a poor, poor little uh, Pikachu. There we go. Imagine trying to do a no, a no items run of this Elite Four. Like, even with us at level 55, this shit ain't easy. Oh. How dare you. Yeah, why is she on her knees? She knew that she was going to lose. 
bow to us. You're better than I thought. <laughs> Go on ahead. <laughs> you only got a taste of Pokemon League power. Bye. Let's go, Chase. How does Chase feel about this, by the way? Oh, he's in big love. He was thrilled because Lorelai was on her knees. Yeah, Chase, come on. <laughs> Be cool with the lady on her knees. Come on. Get your mind out the goddamn gutter. That's actually one of the funny things I noticed is that when you see her in the anime and you see, like, that's how she's supposed to look like? Because... yeah. yeah. It, because uh, if you remember how she looks like in the anime, it looks very different from her sprite. And I feel eventually the sprite has changed over time to better fit with the anime version of it. But in the original one, I was like, she did not look like this at all. And then eventually she just turned into uh, what we know now. I'm not going to talk for Bruno because Bruno sucks. And I think Bruno is the weakest of the lead four. I don't know why he's not first. Doesn't he have like onyxes and shit? Yeah, that's the thing is that he's rock types. He's basically Brock, but way... He fighting types, too. And here's the thing. Watch. Okay, so... Jax is just going to one-shot all of uh, what Bruno has. Because Bruno ain't, ain't shit. He's basically a nothing person. I don't know why we have to fight him. <laughs> <laughs> He's a nothing man. He's a nothing man. This Hitmonchan, I think, has Thunder Punch. It's not going to matter. He's never going to hit with it. He's going to die to Surf right now. Because <laughs> Bruno fucking sucks. He There's no type advantage at all. Yeah, just dead because you're oh, fucking because you're dead because you fucking suck. He does suck. The latch, no, no change. He's just gonna die to a um, uh, fucking turtle that is using nothing but surf over and over and over again. Don't even care. The Hitmonlee's throwing up the gang signs as much as as cool as that is. Dead. He's also fucking dead. <laughs> what? What? You got next? Oh, you got Onyx. Oh, okay, that's cool. You know what Onyx is now? He's fucking dead because I'm using Surf again. <laughs> and my brother just said damn over my long tirade over Bruno. Bruno. Yeah, fuck Bruno. Like, look at this. My champ, nothing. Now, here's the thing. I'm not 100% sure if my champ will lose to Surf, but let's find out. I think it will, but we'll find out. Now, he might have enough special defense to not die to Surf. And the answer is barely. Just barely. Oh, it would have been so hilarious. What's your retort? Yeah, nothing. Like I said. Oh my god, that was a crit. That was a crit. Bruno is a fucking waste of a space of the Elite Four. They may as well call it the Elite Three and not <laughs> let you fight Bruno at all. <laughs> and the reason I know this is because I've played Pokemon Yellow so much as a kid that I know Bruno is a fucking waste of time. Breathe it there, Chief Bruno. Go face your your challenge. Here's a good thing I think they add in later games is I think um, in later gens when you try and talk to Bruno he will face the opposite side of you. He will not look you in the face after he loses. It's funny. Jax barely lost anything so it's up to me the world's strongest Butterfree to take down what might actually be the scariest uh, person in the Elite Four. That old Duff was once tough and handsome. That was decades ago. Now he just fiddles with his Pokedex. He's wrong. Pokemon are for fighting. Cam, I'll show you how a real trainer fights. This old lady just taking us a task. This is an old lady who feels like she was she was like one sentence away of call, from calling him a millennial. <laughs> All right. Dirty millennial trainers. Dirty millennial ass trainers. Fight anymore. Trying to use Mega Drain. Trying to drain the youth out of me. <laughs> And then I'm going to put him to sleep. Why asleep. aren't you buying diamonds? <laughs> why aren't I buying? I'm the reason why the divorce uh, market has fallen down. Why aren't millennials getting divorced anymore? What is love? <laughs> oh, okay. Oh, uh, you're going to really... This is a pain in the ass because I only have 10 shots at Psychic. <laughs> Oh, that is kind of obnoxious. Yeah, this is the only of uh, Elite Four member that I actually get to have some screen time against. Because otherwise they're just going to beat the shit out of me because I'm a Butterfree. <laughs> so, oh yeah, she's got all the poison types. Yeah. Because there wasn't enough ghost types to make her the ghost trainer. Exactly. So she's got nothing but like Gengars and shit. So it's time for me to go. No, don't wake up. <laughs> I was going to say it's time for me to go hard while you go to sleep. <laughs> Aw, oh, damn, it's not going to work because she used fucking Substitute. I hate I hate this old... Oh, it does work? <laughs> Alright, going to go. Keep going hard in the background. 
Yeah. Yeah, this is all this has all been built up for this one moment. Alright, one more hardened and I think I'll be good to fight anything she has. This is like the op the sleeping substitute doll is pretty great. Yeah, it is. I like the substitute doll because that is the actual Poke doll like look. And I think it should go down. Yeah, substitute broke. I love Gengar so much. His giant happy. Yeah, Gengar is one of my favorite Pokemon ever. He's so fucking cool looking, and he's his smile is sinister as fuck, and he's so hard to get. It sucks that he's one of the trading Pokemon. Yeah, he gets down. I continue my reign. There's actually one Pokemon in her party that has a chance to take me down in one hit, and she's not using it yet, because she realizes that I only have ten psychics in me. <laughs> she's making sure to stretch out your airtime. Exactly. I only have I only have four blasts left in me, and then I have to rely on the common cannon, better known as Solar Beam. And we all know that Solar Beam has not killed a single person once. <laughs> okay, this Arbok might uh, one shot me if I'm unlucky, but let's see. Never mind. Apparently, I'm just gonna fucking knock it out of the park right now. <laughs> all right. Now here's the thing. I think I'm out of psychics because I don't. It's gonna take me more than three. To kill Gengar. So I'm going to put it to sleep. And then if that doesn't work out, I'm going to use the common cannon. Better known as Sil Solar Beam. Solar Beam's not even going to do any damage to it because it resists grass type attacks. I know. It's unfortunate, but what are you going to do? You know what? Maybe when it's sleeping. Let's see how much it does. I'm going to see if I can finish it off with the common cannon. It takes two turns. You have it to absorb sunlight. Like I said, it's not a practical move. It's my move, though. It's <laughs> I do this for common. Okay, we're gonna kill it with Solar Beam. Let's go, common cannon. One more time. Absorb all the energy of the earth. Common, can you I'm hear me? I'm gonna laugh my ass off if it wakes up and kills you right You here. son of a bitch. <laughs> you old bastard. <laughs> How dare you? <laughs> the, is the Really? Ah, oh, fuck me. Okay, psychic. <laughs> the common cannon continues to have a zero win streak. I tried. I tried my damn this. Okay, so it is not effective. So for everyone out there who ever doubted the fact that we we're gonna go into the Elite Four with a Butterfree, I just fucking one shot at Agatha <laughs> with a Butterfree. Said, Thank you. Woohoo, you're something. Thank you. Not all millennials are bad. What the old Duff sees in you how. I have nothing else to say. Run along now, child. Typical old person. Okay. I think uh, there's one... Yeah, I'm going to start with Chase on this one because I think fucking Lance starts with... Um... Um... He starts with... What the fuck is the name of that Pokemon? It is... Jackal? Gyarados. He starts with Gyarados. Gyarados? Yeah, he starts with Gyarados. Because... Oh, I thought for sure it was Aerodactyl. No, he doesn't... It... Aerodactyl his is an ace in the hole after you've killed all his Dragonairs. They're virtually indestructible. This is basically like Kaiba's great, great alternate self. <laughs> Lance is Kaiba if he was a good guy and was really into dragons, but in a different way. All right, Gyarados. Chase is just going to thunderbolt him because he doesn't need to use thunder. Yeah, that's all he needs. Yeah. Poor Gyarados suffers from the worst. Like, literally, he sne you, you hit him with one lightning attack and he's done for like there's no point Three socks on the carpet and it's over <laughs> yeah static electricity all right dragon air all right get ready for mr eat your butt because he's gonna eat all these dragons in one go so here's the thing someone told me to do is to use x accuracy with a uh, guillotine oh that's actually smart yeah. The only thing is is that if he's faster than me, it's not going to work. Never mind. <laughs> he's not faster. <laughs> One hit KO. All right. The dragon there. All right, let's see. The only thing I'm not sure about is his uh, Dragon Knight. Dragon Knight might be the one Pokémon where I'm like I'm not sure if that's going to hit. One hit KO. <laughs> Mr. Eat your butt. Getting it done. He is eating all the butt right now. He is eating just nonstop ass right now. Are you kidding me? This is like literally the victory tour of everyone <laughs> as they beat the shit out of everyone. Can you? Are you faster? No! Damn oh. it. That's bad. Miss E, but no, don't die, don't die. Okay, oh, it's God. not. Okay, so you can't use uh, that against him. But he can use. Let's 
do? Oh, you're going to use fucking sword? All right, one moment. I'm going to heal Mr. Yebud and hope that he can take this, uh... Take this attack. Max potions. <laughs> I just realized we have two insects on the team. That's funny. Because I forgot that I'm also technically a bug type. Oh god. Oh, oh no! God. Oh, Damn no. it, it was a fucking crit. Oh, it was a critical hit. No! You bastard. All right. The, the important thing is that Mr. E but totally did guillotine two dudes to death, so it's fine. Yeah, he, he ripped off the heads of two Dragonairs. So now Jax is gonna come in with the fucking ice beam. I'm not trying to. Not, I'm trying to make sure that Jax just doesn't accidentally solo every single person here, because <laughs> he's uh -oh. certainly strong enough to. What is this oh, Aerodactyl swift. move set? He's like what is Swift for? Yeah, I don't know. Now here's a good question: Can Chase take down a uh, a Dragonite all by himself? That's a good question. I think it's time we just checked it out. I saw that one episode of Pokemon. He totally has a chance. He just needs to climb inside its mouth. Oh, look at Dragonite's dumbass look. So adorably dumbass. Yeah, Dragonite's adorable. I love Dragonite. He's going to get hit by that thunder, though. Oh, crit. That's pretty good, but not very effective. Oh, you're going to fire blast Chase in the face? <laughs> That's not good. No, it's not good. Oh, but he lives. Time to do his uh, signature move. He's going to toss this fucking Dragonite into the air, suplex style. He just needs to live one more. Survive! Chase, no! No, he's dead. <laughs> no, he's quite dead. He went out with style, though. He went out like a fucking champ. All right, time to go in with JX. Ice Beam. There's no way he's going to live that. This is before, I guess, the Elite Four just started using full restores like a bunch of assholes. I guess so. Yeah, because I realized this that nothing is really... That's it? I hate it. I hate to admit it, but you are a Pokemon master. <laughs> if it just glitched and said, I hate. That would be really funny. I believe my dragons have lost to you, Cam. You are now the Pokemon League champion. Or you would have been, but you have one more challenge ahead. You have to face another trainer. His name is... Dokkan, he beat the Elite Four before you. He's the real Pokemon League champion. So we have to take down Dokkan. I'm I the real champion. Why do you gotta get shitty about it? We're both the champion. Yeah, also I'm gonna just use these max revives because uh, we're not gonna be using them against uh, Dokkan. I'm gonna call yeah. it right now. So it's time to use them. Bring back Mr. Eat Your Butt. <laughs> or why is Toast the only one on the team with no capital letters? Um, <laughs> because he's the odd man out. <laughs> My brother asking the real questions as to why he's the only one. Because at a certain point, I forgot how to do it. So there you go. I'm going to let you see some play because you're going to be taking down the fig Zenrot. Because if he's like the other Dokkan, he's going to be using. Hey, I was looking forward to seeing you, Cam. My rider's wool should be strong enough to keep me sharp. While working on the Pokedex, I looked all over for powerful Pokemon. Not only that, I assembled teams that would beat any Pokemon type. And now, I'm the Pokemon League champion. Do you know what that means? I'll tell you. I'm the most powerful trainer in the world! By the way, this reveal that your, uh, your rival beat you all the way here. As a kid, I was like, what do you mean there's fucking one more guy? <laughs> <laughs> Because uh, when after I beat Lance, I'm like, well, there's no one above Lance, right? All right, so let's see. You should be faster than him. Yeah. Now take Zenrot takes down fake Zenrot. Now, here's the thing. I forgot, apparently, that Earth types aren't super effective against Earth types. Why would they be? I thought that was the thing. Oh, uh, you know They're what not. I'm thinking? It's because most Earth types are also rock types. That's what I was thinking of. That's why in my mind I was like, okay. I should have just used Slash if that was the case. You know what? No, on... my, I still get bonus damage from using Earthquake. Uh, that's true. But you also crit higher with Slash. It's true. See, as he's hitting me with these Fury Swipes and getting a critical hit every single time. Time to use Slash. Yeah. Took him down. Six levels above you? That doesn't mean shit. 
So he's about to use Alakazam. I forgot that you were also the thing we were going to use to take down Alakazam. Alright. Uh, this is the part where I say I'm not 100% sure how we're going to beat this Alakazam. <laughs> Didn't really have a thought about how to beat him. Okay, never mind. I forgot. The t Dokkan is an idiot with good u with good uh, Pokemon. So Toast is just going to kill. God, kill that did a lot of damage. So Toast is just going to, by accident, be the the reason we killed the strongest Pokemon on Dokkan's team. Come on, come on. Okay, one more. No, you asshole! Don't attack. Uh, don't kill! Don't kill! Don't kill! Come on! Yes. Good job, Toast. Praising Toast at the end. This truly, this lets you know this is the final episode. We're being nice to Toast. Yes. Okay, so Executor. I'm going to let Mr. Yiki Butt have a moment of glory. I just remembered that he's Psychic type, so that might have been very bad. Oh, it's fine. Bugs aren't weak to Psychic. Are they not? Go way around. Hmm, okay. I'm going to use Sword Dance and see if I can slash him to death. Okay, didn't affect Mr. Eat Your Butt. Mr. Eat Your Butt don't sleep. He he just he wakes up, <laughs> eats ass, and goes to bed. That's it. My bad. Eats butt. That is the correct term that he wishes correct. to be. That's the that's yeah. the right that's the right word. Respect his terms. Of course, always. We are we are nothing but a respectful bunch of dudes. As you can tell from our many episodes where we've talked about blowjobs and stuff. Slash and Executor is dead. <laughs> Mistake your butt. Perfect. Alright. Nine tails. Now I'm trying to just make it so that one Pokemon gets a fight and one Pokemon a again. So that everyone very gets Very anime. Yeah, very anime. This is one hundred percent like the end. Jack's finally have he's never used Hydro Pump once. I was saving it for this one fight. Just for this nine tails. Just for this nine tails who decided the tail whip for some reason. Oh, you're so fucking dead, bro. You're so unbelievably dead. <laughs> that was a crit hydro pump. There was no surviving it. Magneton. All right, then. Chase is time to shine. If you guessed it, you know who's the last Pokemon on the team? <laughs> it's Vaporeon. And you know who's the only person who hasn't had a chance to fight yet? Me. So this is going to end with me. Just as it started. This uh, this Pokemon adventure started with two Pokemon, Chase and me. And it will end with Chase and me. I could say I planned it. I did not. I actually did not know he had a Magneton. <laughs> so it was a rich credit. We're going to take credit. Yeah, we're going to take credit for that. As Chase takes down the Magneton. Now here's the thing. Am I totally about to just shit the bed and not actually be able to beat this? Um, uh, you know what this thing is weak to. It's weak to grass types. And guess who has Correct. the world? Guess who has the world's strongest grass type? That's right. I have the what? Go back to sleep. Go back to sleep, you piece of shit. Thank you. First, let me see if Psychic can weaken, because it's a special uh, defense tank, slash just high special attack. There we go. That's a bad sign. So let's do it. Common Cannon! I got eight tries to kill him with the Common Cannon. <laughs> Alright, let's see how much this does. Common Cannon, one. Oh god, please! <laughs> please die! Next turn! <laughs> For the love of God. Please, let Solar Beam get one kill. Common Cannon for the win. Do it. Do it, yes! <laughs> now, match. this is exactly like the end with Cell, where Vaporeon's just getting <laughs> sucked into the light. <laughs> Being blasted apart. I did win. Thank you. My brother just noticed that I won. Dokkan, no! <laughs> that can't be. I also want to look at, has Dokkan always had this pose? Has he always been like this? Or is this a new pose? No, I think this is his douchey champion pose. Okay, because why is he holding two Pokeballs? <laughs> See? Yeah, look, one hand is a Pokeball and the other hand is another Pokeball. 
I don't know. He just wants to look good. All right, that's fair. Well, you look like a fucking scrub because we just beat you. Why? So true. Why did I lose? I never made any mistakes raising my Pokemon. Darn it. You're the new Pokemon League champion. Although I'd like to admit... I like how Chase is not even eyeing Dokkan anymore. <laughs> He's just looking to the side. <laughs> like, eh. I don't really want to look anywhere. So you won. Congratulations. You're the new Pokemon League champion. You've grown up much since you first left with Pikachu. Chase, please. That's his name. Cur Cam, you have come of age. <laughs> It's almost like you guys almost took an entire year to finish a birthday gift. Dokkan, I'm disappointed. I came when I heard you beat the Elite Four. <laughs> oh, that's wrong. But when I get here, you had already lost. Dokkan, do you understand why you it's lost? It's because he took so long getting ready. Yeah, exactly. You forgot to treat your Pokemon with respect. You forgot... Oh, with trust and love. For a second there, I thought he was just talking about actual Dokkan. Without them, you will never become a champ again. Cam. God. You understand that you're... Yeah, he's really laying into it. He's like, I was fucking champion until two minutes ago. Victory was I've not... i champion this whole time. Dick. Nothing I do ever pleases you. Your Pokemon is marvelous. Cam, come with me. Not the loser former champion who's not going to have his victory uh, put into the computer. Uh -huh. Congratulations, Nerd kid. old champion who sucks. Yeah, it's like when uh, Yokozuna was the world heavyweight champion for one WrestleMania, but then Hulk Hogan came in and fucking challenged and took the title away from him. And it was like, why the fuck did any of that happen? Why'd you make him lose? <laughs> Why'd you make <laughs> Yokozuna the champion? Was it so that Bret Hart didn't had to give up the title to Hogan? Is that the reason why you didn't want to turn one heel? I hope you're all understanding this hot <laughs> wrestler lingo. I'm dropping here uh, to become the new league champion. Congratulations, Cam. You and your Pokemon are Hall of Famers. Yeah! Dun-dun. Da -da. Dun -dun. Now let's look at... Yeah! Zenrot, level 55, type 1 ground. Hall of Fame. It's me. Yeah. Hall of Fame, baby. Uh, Chase just yelled out a big old Pika when he showed up. <laughs> oh, that fucking... That ham <laughs> showing up. Jax showing up, level 1. Type 1 water. Yeah! Hall of Fame. I'm going to Photoshop out this specifically and put comment in the background because I feel it was a team effort at the end. Ah, <laughs> uh, Mr. Eat Your Butt. Level 55 Type 1 Bug. Newest member of the crew and yet still more loved than the one who's been here almost the entire time. <laughs> Toaster. Oh, that's kind of, you know, that's just the way it's meant to be, really. Yeah. Toaster, you're fine, too. I love you. We got it here. All right, we saw 134 Pokemon. We caught 47. We've been playing for 30 fucking hours. Looking good. Go find my aid when you get 50. Wow, even when I'm champion, he's like, you could be better. Yeah, you're not doing enough for me. And here it is. Here's the credits to Pokemon Yellow. Made director by a Satoshi Tajiri. Oh, that's going too fast. Man, Zen, we did it. Sure we did. We beat it's the game. Over. It is. This joins the pantheon of the three games we've beaten. One, the Yu Yu Hakusho GB <laughs> Game Boy game. <laughs> Two, Yu-Gi-Oh! The Sacred Cards. And now, Pokemon Yellow, Cam's Adventure. Man. Yeah, that's going to be weird now that we're not going to have... For It was weird enough when we had to stop playing Sacred Cards, but now we're going to stop playing Pokemon as well. No, that's like our whole repertoire. I know. We're going to have to come back eventually with... Uh, what people have been wanting since the first episode, which was to do a Nuzlocke. <laughs> which we will... Wait, like, nine months. Yeah. the that If this took us, like, almost a year, and we weren't even on the... We weren't even nuzlocke imagine how long a Nuzlocke would actually... It actually would take much less, because I'll accidentally get the entire team killed. In, like, the first I gym. I can see that happening. Yeah, totally. Uh, we'll, f we'll go all the way up to Norman and then I'll underestimate Norman and we'll lose to Norman. <laughs> we'll get destroyed by Norman. And his fucking vigor offs and shit. But yeah, so I guess we should say thank you to Chase, Chase and Cam for letting, for one, giving us this series and two, being with us for the entire thing. Absolutely. Yeah. This was a lot of fun. It was. And this is the end. I hope you enjoyed it, Cam. Keep on watching, and we'll keep on entertaining you. 
Hopefully. Hopefully. Hopefully we entertained you for this entire year that we've been doing this. Hopefully. Uh, and if you stop uh, finding us entertaining, that just means you've gotten better taste. <laughs> yeah, you, that means you've grown up. <laughs> Congratulations. This is the end. Goodbye, everyone. Bye.